race. I imagine on a team like this, with this much talent and experience, you have to try to take advantage of the opportunities you have to, to grow as players and to give that experience and everything. Just talk about what a game like this does for, for, for both of you tonight. Um, I would say for me, you know, just being out there, um, it's just a, another way for me to get better. You know, any opportunity I get is just to help my team. So it just meant a lot just to be out there and have fun with my teammates. Uh, for me, it's just about progress. Like, um, compared to the beginning of the season when I came here, I was not in the best shape that I was, and now I feel like I'm in the best shape like I ever been. And the support from my teammates and my the coaching staff has been, has been uh, amazing. And thanks to them, that's why I got what I got today. Ellie, yeah, touching on the uh, the support of your team, is how did it feel to, to you know see the bench explode when you got your tenth rebound? Um, my teammates are my number one supporters. Like on practice, on games, I even outside of practice, like this is my number one supporter. Like. That feeling that they had on the bench made me feel like it was it was the time. Like they've always been there on the bad and the good things, so that was really good for them to do that. Hey, Aaliyah, I don't think we've talked to you since Samaya went down. So when, when you heard the news that she you know wouldn't be available the rest of the year, what was your reaction, and, and sort of how did you um, change your mindset since you knew you'd have to play more minutes? Um, I was sad that. She was out. Injuries happen, and it's always going to happen. Uh, it changed my perspective of the game. Um, I knew I was going to have to step up and play big time minutes on the court, and I had to take advantage of those minutes because you're never going to get those minutes back. For both of you, I I'm wondering if you might can speak on your, your other teammate, because I know you guys played together in high school. How have you seen like, Leah, how have you seen Angelica grow since you guys have been on campus? And Angelica, how have you seen Leah grow since y'all have been on campus? Um, man. I've seen Aaliyah, you know, I've played with her since she came to the United States, so since we were in middle school. And just seeing her put in so much work, it, it was amazing to see her perform like that. And it started with her work ethic. Like, since once we came here, you know, Coach moki has been on her about you know, getting in shape, just being dominant, and like she's rise to the occasion, and I've just been by her side, bad days, good days, and just to see her like play good, you know, after all the hard work, it's so special. I mean, having a point guard that knows how you how you play on the floor is something that you never will get all the time. So like for me, playing with Angelica and the progress she has made since we met in seventh grade has been amazing. Uh, she became more vocal, she became a better leader, she became a better teammate, she just became an overall good player. Uh, Aaliyah, how has playing alongside Angel in practice and games kind of enhanced your game as a post player, especially offensively? Um, playing against her has been a tough battle. We go against each other in practice. Uh, she's my big sister. So she's going to teach me and she's going to tell me what to do, but it's going to be for my own best. And going against her in practice is, is, is tough, but at the end of the day, we both get better. Any more questions for the players? One more back there? Yeah. Uh, for, for Angelica, I feel like being on the bench, you have a front row seat to um, your coach being upset with Blanchard <laughs> or last year with how they handled the ball or way from the offense. And I think there's one point where she kind of said, get it going and then you hold up and hit it three. Uh, how good is that moment feel and how do you kind of take that coaching and continue to get better? Um, you know, it was, a, it was a good moment. Just being able to sit on the bench and learn from those point guards, they are great point guards, you know, and just being able to listen to what Coach Moki has to say. You know, it's not about right now, it's the process of me getting better because, you know, that's just all I want. And just being able to learn and finally go out there and just, you know, make another step forward felt amazing.